saved. And it's not a feeling. Because so, I'm telling you, if you feel saved, you're going to go to hell on any given day by what you feel. Right? How many of you feel saved all the time when, when, when you're doing things and when you're thinking things you know God doesn't approve of? Do you feel saved? Ain't you glad you, your feelings ain't saving you? Yeah. It's faith in what he's told us and what he said, beloved. I bet you Abraham didn't feel like he could go home and make baby. But he believed God and he did. Amen. It's not a feeling. Faith is not a feeling. Okay? Your salvation is not a feeling. It's an assurance. And just as sure as God created the heavens and the earth, beloved, He's coming back to judge this heaven and earth. And all the wickedness and those in it reject Him. If you are not right with Christ, make it right today. If you've got sin you need to confess to Him, confess it to Him and get back in right standing with Him. Quit running from Him. You're not going to get away. Give your life to Christ. There's no freedom. Like the freedom that's in Jesus Christ. No freedom. You can count on Him. You can trust Him to the end. I'm not going to get on Him. But you can trust Him and you can believe Him to the end. And that's when you receive the salvation of your souls, beloved. The end of your faith. Amen. Not when you were 10. When you said a little five minute prayer or whatever. Nope. So make your calling and election sure. Work out your salvation with trembling and fear, because it is God which worketh in you, both to do the will and to do of His good pleasure. Amen. Amen. Questions or comments? Anybody want to confess Christ?